Mail day! Is it your phone that did that? No. It was the house? Oh, yeah, it was. No, it was. Okay, the oh. Mail day! Mail day! What do we got, guys? Heavy. Heavy. Looks like a guitar. Oh, dude, let's get it. Let's get it. I want to be Sledgehammer. Here we go, y'all. All right, it's got some straps and some buckles and some things. So we're going to have to do a little poofing. A little poofing. I think they staple it close, too. Uh, they have to bust out if not. I didn't even have a box. I told you that. I didn't know. That's why you said, do I want a box from Amazon? I was like, yes. I lift. So guys, here's what we got. A new high lift, 48 inch jack. Uh, ooh, it's all got grease and oil all over it. I don't think it had that last time. Maybe it did years ago. Every day, this is what I do. Trail out, put it on here because I lift. I've got a little horrible. I think I'm playing with my truck. If I don't, it sits about, well, eh, fly over the sidewalk. No, they don't walk down my sidewalk. The days come up with anything they can. That's why my address is huge on my house and all that stuff because they said my other letters weren't big enough. But let's not get into that. Let's not ruin a happy mail day. Stay there. So, here. You're like, why do you need a new it's one? It's not oily. It's just fresh paint. No, it's oily. That's the back of here. Well, that's not oil. E okay, here we go. So here's what we got. Old high lift. They look exact same. Like, why do you need a new one? Um, I was not going to get one because I thought it hadn't been that old, but I got it five years ago, almost exactly like right now. So here's the problem. No heavy load. Works fine. Up, 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 up. But now once the load gets on, what's happened is, this is like a pop metal cast iron. Not pop metal cast iron, say. Show them here. This piece here is the divider that holds these two apart as you ratchet up and down. Look, for the spacing. Well, they're spaced just perfect. Well, that hole is worn out in there. Right. There it is, right there. See that all worn out and given? So what's happened is, when I go up, it's down there. Instead of that half an inch more, a quarter inch more. So when I get to the top and there's weight on, it will not slip in the hole. Um, I tried WD-40 and... All kinds of stuff. So as you can see, this is mushroomed. I've been hammering it. I can still use this jack around here if I need parts or for stuff that's not the weight of my trailer. Um, but it just wasn't working anymore. It's going up like that, and it was just stopping. And you'll see. I'll show them right here. See all those nicks there? See, it was just enough that it was catching. See, it wasn't horrible, but it's it is five years old. So it's just a little give. And you're like, oh, why didn't you just buy this part? Well, because the jack's 70 bucks, and I was going to buy this kit that had these pins and springs, which I don't think would have fixed it, and it was 30 So I'm like, I think I'd rather just have a new jack than just some parts. So I imagine this part was going to be 20 Maybe I'll write high lift see if they can hook me up, especially since I bought a new one. High lift, if you watch this, because it is a review of your jack, kind of, can y'all do me a huge, awesome favor since I just bought another one anyway, so I can get some more life out of this guy? Can you send me this part? Right here, I mean, it'd be pretty nice. I don't have a huge mile subscribers, but I got like 3,000 people to watch me. I wish you would tell your friends and more people would watch me, but that just don't happen. So, here we go. Yeah, that's it. I mean, if you get that, and that would do it. This new one of this, or if it's the pin that goes in between, I don't know. It might be the pin in between. Come here, look at it. it looks like it's a little bolt. The pin that goes in between and this part. And, uh... I didn't see a part to find it. Maybe it is. I'll look again. But if not, High Lift hooked me up. I love you, Jack. Enough to buy a second one. I use it every day. Five years. Lift this trailer. Sometimes it's full of, like, debris. Like, full, full of branches and logs. Or the equipment on it. So, you know. It's a heavy trailer, too. You can't lift this. Two of us. We can lift regular people's trailers. 16-footers, no walls. But this has reinforced extra metal on it in that box and there's a big huge metal plate on the front to the can't answer that can't answer it we're busy can't do it we're busy mm -hmm. okay how much time we got left 
Uh, 12 minutes. 12 minutes. We're good. Okay. So let's back to our mail day, original opening. So they got this wrapped good with metal wire so that the handle doesn't come up. So I either have to cut this, I twist it, and I'm feeling like a wimp today. This glove. Oh yeah, the glove. Like a glove. Yeah, like a glove. Oh, I'm clapping in my hand. All right, so here we go. <gasps> I found OJ's other glove. I think they found them both, I don't remember. It, the glove doesn't fit, so you must have quit. Didn't do it. That is loud. Is that behind us? It sounds like it's out front. Alright, there goes my instruction booklet. It's a jack. I don't need an instruction booklet. I think it's like warranty stuff too. Uh, yeah, but it's only a year warranty. You're not gonna break, hopefully not gonna break a jack in a year. Uh, I looked up, you know, just because of the cost. I was looking up some other ones, big red, things like that. And it just didn't seem like they were worth it. And they were 50 to 60 bucks. So I'm like, you know, I'm gonna go with this again. It did work for me. It looks like it's made the same. Um, some people complained about the paint chips off easy. I mean, it does, but it's a jack, and like they're like, oh, you prep it. Um, it's a jack. I mean, complain about paint on a jack. You know what jacks are used for? What's it used for? Work stuff. Working. All right? If you buy a jack, it's for working. And if you're one of them new age Nancy boys that we got in America, like 80% of the dudes, like, but the paint is chipped. It's a jack, dude. You going to work. See my truck? It's got scratches, it's got dents. People are like, hey, what, why don't you buy a brand new truck? Well, I have a nicer truck, show them. Every once in a while, that one goes to work. Um, but it's still a truck. I still use that one sometimes. So, you know, yeah, it's kind of clean right now. I don't know how, because I ain't washed it in forever. You don't do that. Just don't do it. Go to work, be a man, not a Nancy. Or if you're a woman watching this, the truth is, a lot of you are a lot tougher than the guys lately. So, ladies, don't complain about the paint either if you are, but you probably aren't if you're out here working. All right, so here we go. Here's the new jack. Nice thing is, this broke very early on, years ago. You could probably buy this at any hardware store. I was going to go to Adva uh, Handyman, True Value, and see if they had them. I'm sure they did. It's just a spring, like a hose or belt tensioner. You just boom. And the reason they have it is it's a neat idea. They thought up, look, those clips, because of the pressure of it being open that much, boom. It's a handle. It works. See? Mine broke off. Part of it's there, half it. So it'll is break it off. Still? Yeah, part of it's on. The other part, the other half broke oh, yeah. two or three years ago. Alright, so yeah. I mean, it, oh my gosh, you see it? The paint is scuffed right there. I'm gonna leave a bad review. That's what the bad reviews are, y'all. They're about paint scuffs and stuff. Look, they didn't even ship in the box. Buy it from Amazon and ask Amazon to put it in the box. They will, look. Made it easier for my mail. Didn't cost any more. Didn't cost any more. Made it easier for my mailman. It looks like it's designed the exact same. So, I mean, there's nothing I'm worried about not working. This so, piece looks kind of bigger. Turn it around. This one? It could be because it's new and shiny. Turn it around. What part? Turn it around. This piece. It could just be that it's what piece? That where it says high low. The whole area? Yeah. No, it's the same. Is it? Let's see. Let's pick it up and look. Well, this is still a working jack, guys. I thought about I just buying the same. part, but I mean, I'm using it for work, so why not buy the new one if it's going to be so much? Like I said, high lift. Come on, dude. Hook me up. Sponsor with a free part, and I'll put high lift in, at the bottom of all my videos. So I'll get high lifted. I mean, it looks the same. Um... <clears throat> As you can see, I use this one. I mean, I use it every day, so it gets work. Twice a day. Twice a day at least, yep. So, it looks, I mean, I don't see any difference. Anybody else see something else different? Mm -hmm. Oh, yep, you know what? I can see the part that I was talking about now. Look, it actually might not be this. It's that more. The pin, I mean, it wore it out a little. The metal wore a little, but look, the pin was bigger. Yeah. What's that best right there? Everybody's like, we came to see you open mail day. And you're just rambling. Well, you know what, then? You ain't been to my channel before. This is what I do. Yep, see the pin? Mm -hmm. It got worn out a little. See it? So that and, and this part of it. the pin got wet. worn out or did the metal the get... The pin 
and that. Look, this is yeah. shaped. See, it's shaped the metals a little. Mm -hmm. But see the pin, you can see grooves. Look, there's yeah. no grooves. Just over time, uh, I wonder if I would replace that pin itself with the ones. I could probably find that, like anywhere, just a piece of metal that size and shove it in there and make it better. I'm actually gonna try that later. I'm gonna see if I have a bolt that size. I'm gonna cut it off on the end, zit zit, make it long enough and shove it through there and see if it works. But yeah, there we go. I mean, we're gonna have to work with it. We're gonna show you how this thing works. It's pretty simple. It's a beast. Like, oh, this thing is unsturdy, it could kill me. Um, you guys do know what kind of jack this is, right? Use a bottle jack, use a scissor. You know how long a bottle jack takes to open up and lift this trailer every day? Um, this jack is made for that reason. So, when you're not ready, like you want to lift it, you can just pull up and it'll get you to your spot where you have to start lifting. Well, and the bottom wobbles so that it can get it. So, if you're off road, yeah. flat, off ground, yes. But they do, I mean, they move. You got to be a man to use this. Look, when you pop this up, this is how you do it. If you're offside, like right now I did a little angle, I put my hand here, show. And I hold it so the trailer doesn't go. You see, this is the metal come on. This trailer is heavy. It's extra, extra heavy. Uh, you're like, that ain't that heavy. I can lift it. You're on drugs. I used to be able to squat like 800 pounds. Eight, 900 pounds. And my employee who's almost as strong as me together I think we could lift it and have to drop it I think we got it like an inch or two and would have to drop it this thing's a beast okay where you at good that's good this is what we do every morning do this she backs it in put it down and we're done so it gets used every day now that's why I was a little worried because I'm like why is it bad already it felt new but it's five years old it's like this is stupid I don't want to buy a new one. All it does is lift this trailer. I mean, it is heavy, but it ain't so heavy this jack shouldn't be able to do it. So, it's a good jack. And like I said, all that's wrong with it is that pin might make a difference, just that pin. But I really need that part again. So, high lift. I'm begging. Kind of hate to be a beggar. Can't be a chooser. But I bought a new one. I'm going to keep it. I just like to have the other one as a backup two, two at a time. One I'll carry in the truck all the time. What do you think? Hook me up. I love your product. Just point out that that pin goes, which it is metal. It's metal rubbing over and over it goes. Uh, we gotta do this, so give me the camera, you go back it up. Back it up. Mm. Back it up. Mm. Come on, girl, just back it up. Back it up. You're like, what is he singing? I don't know, I just made it up. Back it up. Back it up. Back it up, homeboy, just like that. Y'all like that? That thing got a hemi in it. Turn the wheel to the right a little. Hey, right there. Come on back. Got about a foot. Slow. Still about a foot. You're a little over a foot. Six inches. That's what she said. Come on. All the way to the right wheel. Okay. You got about that far. Uh, that should be perfect. Stay right there. Watch this, y'all. We're going to show you. This is how we do it around here. So, you, Oh, I forgot to show you. So you lift this up to go up. And you go down, you just go. Some people complain about how hard it is. Um, it's not really, I mean, don't be a Nancy. Uh, you want to hang on to this handle. I'm not going to do it because I don't want it coming all the way down. This thing, if you're not hanging on to this handle, when it goes down, it will repeatedly, look, it will hit, fling, hit, fling, hit, fling, and it will knock you out. It will break your face. I'll show you when we're done. I'll put it on and let it do it itself. Why is it not going down? Uh-oh. I think the jack's broke, brand new. I think it's broke. Put it in park. Come on back here, turn it off. She got the camera so I can figure it out. I think the jack's messed up, y'all. It's brand new, dang it, it moved. It's not going down, yeah. That was a horrible review for you. Did do that during the middle, so I'm gonna jack it back up once to see if I screwed up the rotation by doing that. To show you, okay? I might have screwed up its mechanism. There it goes. No. What? It's sticking a little. Yeah. It's sticking right there, y'all. Jack's already there, it goes. But why is it not always doing it? 
I think it's because of the mechanism I did or because it's so brand new stuff rubbing. We're going to have to update y'all on the review on this because uh, this isn't what it's supposed to be doing. It's supposed to be going down. There it goes. It's not. It's right now, it should be going down. Hit. Down. It's not clicking. Yeah, I know. Like goes. every other time it is. Yeah. Supposed to pop out and then. Maybe you're going down to. No? I mean, I go down fast all the time with it. There it goes, it's sticking. Okay, I don't know, I think it's because it's brand new. It's probably, look, the paint's fresh. Rub it on the hole. We're gonna find out after I get it going a few. Uh, but here's what happened, y'all. This thing, the way the mechanism works, I wanted to show y'all, is, uh, can you put your, no. You only have two minutes. So okay, less than this two thing, minutes. when it goes down, there's a click here, and if you don't hang on to this, it hits the click, and it sends it back up. And it goes, it will ride itself all the way down, and like I said, this thing will, boom, I mean, it'll break your jaw. So respect this, Jack. Um, I don't want to tell you, I'm having a little problem with it, so it might go back, I don't know. Uh, we'll find out later today. I might make use it later and see if maybe it just needs to break in for a few uses. The paint's still tight and everything. So, yeah, there's my mail day. This is a high lift. That isn't a good selling point on it because it did have trouble putting it down already. So, got me worried. As always, I'm RJ. Seize the day each and every day.